Hey everybody, Laura Dilly back here with some tricks for highlight and contouring for you. You do not have to look like her and be all knowing how to put everything wherever and have a million tools to put it there. Okay, you can highlight and contour with just a few simple steps, a few simple products that you already have. Your bronzer, blush, and your concealer, which we've already done. If you haven't watched my Conceal the Teal, I've already concealed the teal. I'm taking the same, the light colored concealer, and I'm gonna highlight with this. I'm just gonna highlight a little bit underneath my eyes. I've kinda already did that, so just to show you, you do wanna do like a, um, a V shape underneath the eyes. I do up here on the forehead, down the nose, think of where light hits your face, above the lip, and the chin. Okay, so I know that looks crazy, but hold on to your hats, people. I'm going to take the bronzer. I feel like Angie Castellano. Stop it with the tricks, people. That's like a British Angie Cast Castellano. My bad. Okay, so I'm just taking the concealer and my angled blusher brush. I like to use the angled blusher brush because it's smaller and I can concentrate on a small area. And you want to just contour underneath your cheekbone. So I go from like the line of my ear down to about right here, not all the way to the lip. And same thing, just underneath the cheekbone. Okay. Stop it with the tricks, people. That's not any better, is it? Okay. Along the side of the nose, so the highlight here and then the contour on the side is going to give you a slimming factor around the nose. And then up here on the forehead. Also, I do along the right here and along the chin to make me look super skinny. Skinny, skinny, mini. And there's that. And now I'm just gonna blend. I'm just taking an empty brush. I'm gonna blend out the lines so I have no harsh lines. Use this. Use a blending bud or use a brush, whatever you have. Just make sure it's an empty. Huh? Got a little of my lipstick there. Ah, oh, my hair is getting all in the, all up in there. Okay. So there. I just like to finish it off with a little blush. And I take a powder puff brush, which is weird because I use the blusher brush for the contour, but I like to use this just because it gives a, a bigger area, oops, sorry, on my cheek. And I just go a little bit above. Where I went for the contour. And then I take that same blending brush and I just kind of mix the two together so there's no lines and that's it. Blush, bronzer, concealer, already have it, boom, contoured.